This is a video about flagging feature in Jira, which I personally find very helpful, uh, especially for those of you who work who follow Scrum during their development. Uh, you obviously do daily stand-ups and daily Scrum report has such an important part in it as um, reporting blockers. Uh, blockers is the main thing that slows down or pauses your process, so you want to know about blockers as soon as possible. And sometimes uh, people think uh, they have to wait for daily scram to report a blocker, uh, which is not the right case. You should be able to report blockers anytime, uh, any second they show up. And uh, Jira also has a tool to help you and your team report blockers without having to wait for next day, uh, next daily stand up and scram. This is called flagging. You can use flagging on a um, uh, board, Kanban board, or in a backlog as well. So, how it works, you just, uh, I'm using my laptop, so for me it's double touch on a card and context menu shows up. Uh, for those of you using mouses, maybe it's um, maybe it's right click. I can't really remember at this point. And uh, anyways, um, this menu shows up, and you see there is an option add flag, and a window shows up which tells you add a flag. The right way to add a flag is you refer to a person who is blocking you if you know uh, who that is, who can help you in the. Uh, you choose that person and you descri describe your blocker. For example, I need designs to build this view. Uh, then, you, uh, then you just add a blocker. And on your board, this card is uh, going to be going to have a flag, a red flag, and it's going to be highlighted in yellow. So everybody who looks at the board, they can see right away at just one glance, they see blocked issues. And a person who is blocking you will actually receive a notification to their email. They will know they're blocking you and uh, they will know they have to do something to unblock you. Uh, and when they do so, they can use the same feature, uh, remove flag. It's now called remove flag. So if I'm unblocking this issue, I'm choosing remove flag. And I'm uh, talking to a person who, for example, um, tagged me here. And I'm giving you a link to designs. And I'm adding this remover. So right now this task has a normal view. And this way, it's a tool, flagging is a tool to communicate a blocker at any point uh, over time, over development, so you don't have to wait for next day, daily scrum stand up. Flagging is also a tool for a team, the whole team, at first glance to see issues on a project, blocked uh, stories, blocked subtask. And it's a great way to communicate blocking and unblocking because, you know, in the Scrum team, you can have uh, a lot going on. And uh, if you just uh, select somebody or Skype somebody, hey, I need designs, you can just get lost in communications. But when it's right there on the board, it's clear communication. So I love this feature very much and I hope you'll find it useful.